Hello, this is Genosis with episode 9 of Subnautica Below Zero, the Hardcore Vegetarian Challenge. Well, let's see, go, go to Crystal Cave, beat game, don't die. That is our, that's our objective. Now, I'm trying to recall what the, let's see, go to our databank here. See if I can recall where about these Crystal Caves are supposed to be. I'm right, gonna kind of feel my way around, see if I can remember where it is. I believe it is... Gosh, where was it? Where I got those spiral plants, and then further into that area, if I'm not mistaken. I'm gonna feel my way around it. I believe it is to the... Gosh, what area would that be? To the east? Hold on. Um, yeah, east, west, southeast, something like that. I think it's around that area. So, again, I'm playing off memory, see if I can manage that. Oh, hold on. Hold everything. Wait, my boost slows down here. There. I uh, crafted a couple of uh, ion cells. Where, where are they? Yes, ion power cells. I feel like I heard something nasty out there. All right, so let's see if we get those uh, installed. Here we go, power cell and ion power cell. Yeah, these will give a much larger uh, capacity there than the standard. All right, with that settled, let's head on to the way, see if we can uh, find that location. Now, I grabbed a lot of advanced uh, crafting supplies and stuffed it in my containers, because I, I believe I need to craft the last body part, and you learn how to get that body part down to those caves. You also need a resource you only find down there, and that is Kyanite. So that's those the blue crystals that's required for pretty much all the, the end game advanced stuff. So uh, I also need additional depth modules. Again, so I try to bring as much stuff with me as possible. So that way, we don't have to come back. I'd love to be able to finish it in this episode, if I can manage it. All right, here's Marguerite's area. So yeah, I think it was below here is where you could access the uh, crystal cave area. Again, it's been so long since I've had access area and I'm trying to do the best I can without looking up things, but I think this is, I think this is it. Yep, that, those are purple crystals. Oh boy. All right, so the main thing I'm looking around here is kyanite. That is absolutely required for me to be able to progress any further. Ah, there we go. Any friends around? All right, yoink. Yeah, see if I can get <laughs> Enough of that. Oh, what is this? Torpedo arm. Interesting. I'm going to try to proceed carefully and swim around here. I don't want to take the truck uh, through these crystals, but right here. Yeah. I can't recall how much kyanite I need to get that crafted. But uh, I may have to make a little outpost just to get it done. All I all really need is one of those two bases. Shouldn't take too long to get this uh, established. All right. It'll hatch now. Uh, now... So yeah, yeah. Now, just to see about getting myself a, uh, what's it called? Yes, a modification station. That is all we're going to need. I think we need a computer chip. All right, let's not talk about how far I had to swim to get some table coral. All right, finally back to base, and now we have a modification station. So, what? Oh, it needs to be powered, I suppose. Yeah, that's what I want to hear. All right, let's go ahead and self upgrade to our multi purpose room. And uh, see if I can get a uh, bioreactor set up, because that's probably the best uh, best I can do down here, just for a little bit of power. Emergence. The amount of screwing around and doing around between cuts is actually pretty embarrassing. <laughs> I did not plan that I needed to uh, be able to craft anything. All right, so there is power. Are you actually generating power? There is these vents. Oh, that might be enough. Uh, just need a titanium. There we go. Power obtained. All right, modification station. Let's see, see a truck. Oh, I need to take off the, uh, ooh, the depth module. Uh, that is going to cause some crushing damage. I need to fix this up before I do that. All right, now for a quick hot swap. Oh God, let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know, I know. All right, here we go. And depth module. Gimme, 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 gimme. And it's right before we uh, have a crushed can of whatever hell I have stored in here. Uh, there we go. Thousand meters. How was the damage? Eh, not bad. Now let's try to perform the procedure on the prawn suit. Yoink. And prawn suit upgrade. At least I planned that far ahead. Interestingly enough, I don't think it's getting damage. Yeah, and since it's docked, it's not getting crushing damage, which, uh, hey, look at it. Huh. Neat. There we go. 1100 meters. Now we're ready. I'm going to whip up a quick beacon and drop it here in case I need to come back here. This might be my uh, 
quick base of operations if I need it again. Just want to make sure, you know, I can find it if I need to. Here we go. We're going to call you Crystal Base. Gotcha. All right, now for the fun part. Let's uh, proceed into the <laughs> Leviathan home where you'll find the absolute worst things in the game down below. Oh boy. Now I believe there's two parts to this step of the game. One is to find the, uh, the scan the body part that's underneath a crystal area somewhere. And then there's this red crystal area that has the, fa it's a fabricator station that lets you craft Alan's body. Then after you do that, I believe it's pretty much game over. You uh, run over to some sort of portal you would teleport yourself out into whatever is beyond that portal, which we've seen the end of the game, you would know. So yeah, that's uh, that's the plan here. Now, right now, I'm feeling my way around to see if I can find that underground area, which is just really following the contours and try to find see where it dips down. Oh, or I could go down to this crystal thing here. Is this leading to fabricator caverns or is this something else? No, I think this is what I'm looking for. Ah, uh, yes, that. It could help you build my body. My body. All right, now we're talking. Okay, some some alarm bells are ringing in my head now. I think I know what I'm doing. All right, it's a little force field here. Oh, all right. I guess we're on foot. Ooh, fancy. I don't know. Nice this place looked. Aha! Aha! Ha! Architect component. It looks like uh, the organs. Constituent parts. You will be able to construct bionic organs with the scanned material, both primary and secondary. Our designs provide for redundancies. Given your current location, I think they could still be improved. Your feedback has been noted. <laughs> okay, some of the dialogue's pretty good. And all the components we need to make a storage of body. Are you excited? Using the chemical compounds available in your body. I am able to approximate what you might call cautious optimism. All right, so that aside, that should give us everything we need to craft the body parts. I believe I have it all stored onto the truck. Oh, I went the wrong way. So yeah, I'm trying to avoid having to head back to the surface, try to go for all in one shot, get the body scanned, get the body parts done, head to the fabricator caverns, fabricate the body, get the GTF out of here. So that's the plan. All right, moment of truth. Oh, let's answer this one. We have gathered the necessary components to begin constructing my body. Great, what's next? Let's get you out of my head. First, you must find the fabrication facility. It is concealed at some depths. Fabrication facility? So you planned on needing to make new bodies? It is a standard medical facility. A medical facility where you just replace your whole body when it wears out? Sounds a little beyond standard to me. Ours was a research mission of the highest importance. So, what were you, a scientist like me? I am a scientist now. So, what happened? Your team found the vaccine and then... Please, Robin, you have the components. Find the facility and construct the body. Okay, but don't think I don't notice you changing the topic. Yeah, that's, uh, as the kids would say, sus. The crystals in this environment are confusing my senses, and yet I feel certain there is something important below. A facility, or a body component. Perhaps both. I can't yeah. tell. Yeah, that's what we're waiting for. So let's head over to wherever he just pointed us towards. Alright, so for some reason I thought I needed the fabricator in order to craft the body parts, but I think it's the fabricator facility that can do that. Now, I believe that's to the east, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, we'll find out. I'm looking for red crystals. Oh, yeah, yeah, we found some red crystals. I'm uh, Okay, you know what? I'm going to say something. I was going to say something, but I'm not going to. Because that's called a jinx. All right, this place says, be nervous. I'm sure there's... Uh, yeah. I'm sure there's going to be something that's unpleasant around here. I'm not going to say what. Just going to acknowledge that uh, we could be in danger right now. Oh, yeah. Danger. Oh, boy. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. Oh, please, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Oh. 
Okay, all right, we're out of here. Gave you a little nip, and I'm zooming away. Now, I don't know where the hell I'm going. Oh, wait, wait, that looks... Yeah, that looks like a thing. I don't suppose we can drive straight in, huh? Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Oh. And then we can oh. you out of my head. Oh. All right. A little bit of a heart attack, but we're okay. Oh, uh, this place looks uh, ominous. Let's get our flashlight out so we see see what we're doing here. All right. So I wonder if I can grab components. Plasteel. Okay. Uh, okay, I can do this one. Wait. Oh, I need it on me. Okay, so let's see. Um, plasteel, polyaniline, polyaniline, and diamond. Polyaniline? Diamond? Alright, three left. I don't have enough titanium. Oh god, I'm gonna die down here. I right, probably should use my prawn suit. That thing was gonna eat me in one bite. Okay, this. Oh, no, no. What are we doing? Get back in there. Oh, oh okay, I guess I'm stuck. That's fine. Or in the prawn suit, and hopefully that thing stays way the hell over there. I'm just looking for a little bit of titanium. It's bound to be something. I've been gathering little bits here and there. Um, I, I would I would just like a little bit more, so we can get situated. Oh yes, yes. Give me something. Come on now. I can't believe we're down here looking for titanium. This is a. Uh, I was gonna be all smart and planned, but look at what I'm doing. All right, that should be enough titanium. Please let it be enough titanium. All right, grab all of that. And maybe we can just do it straight in here. All right, now that you got all the titanium, we need to try to fabricate those parts. Because you can't, like, prefabricate things right at the uh, at the thing. Um, we need... Yes, plasteel ingot. There we go. I don't, recall, I don't recall what else we need, so let's just walk in there. Fabricate what we can. Oh, boy. Try to get this done. I am... On edge. All right, let's try this again. Uh, use fabricator. So, Alan. There we go. You said your people came here. Okay, one done. So you came number two. To search for. All right, part number two. Now, do we have everything for this one? Mm, oh, I need another kyanite. Really? Gosh, darn it! I think I saw one re uh, pretty close by. Oh, that was close. Oh. All right, I'm not seeing any kyanite around, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to de detach everything here and run around in just this little speedy sea truck uh, after give it a little bit of a repair and try to search that for last kyanite. I, why do I have to make this so stressful for the, what's supposed to be the home like the home stretch? Oh god, there's two of them in here. Ooh, just get me out of here. Oh, don't consent. No. Mm -mm. Let me out of here. Aha, there's a kyanite right there. Okay, then we're back into the other... Well, on the edge of the red crystal area. Are we... We're here and he's moaning and screaming. Oh, please just let me get this. Grab a little bit extra, just in case. All right. Now, <laughs> let's go back in there. Oh, there's a kyanite over here. Well, that was... That would have been handy a second ago. Uh, we're gonna get a we're gonna get a friend here in a second. Okay, just leave me alone. Okay, please let this be it. No being followed. Let me out of here. Okay, please just, just let this. All right, here we go. Architect organs. Ugh, three kyanite. I okay, ion cube. I don't think I have the ion cube on me. Okay, there you go, ion cube. Uh, I think that is everything I need. All right, I'm sure that's it. Architect Orions. Oh my god, thank god. Oh, here we go. Don't mind if I do. How about you shut up and just do the thing? Well, that's fancy. Alright, initiate transfer. Let's get this done. Ooh. Hey. And then he snaps her neck. Okay, let's get the hell out of here and get this game finished. All right, so in theory, I don't need uh, anything of this stuff anymore. I just need to get home. So I'm going to grab just my truck and skedaddle, leaving all of this crap behind because I don't need it. Home stretch, baby. I said home stretch. Oh, oh no. 
Oh no, no, no. Okay, all right. There was two of them. All right, so out of the crystal area, now to find our way out of here. I'm trying to remember my last playthrough. I think I remember hugging the right wall. Yeah, I'm at crystal base. <laughs> That's actually really handy. That'll tell me how to get out of here. Oh, I hear unfriendly behind me. Unfriendly. Unfriendly. Ugh. All right, there's our base location. I believe it is up from here. And then we're out of Leviathan territory. All we need to do is go to that phase facility at, the, I think it's Outpost Zero. It's a direction we didn't take last time. Yeah, and then we're done. We're out of here. I don't really think there's much else that could kill us. I think this is the home stretch, which means we beat the game without dying and without eating any fish. Now, there was a bit of discourse regarding the, um, the anemone, because in real terms, uh, anemones are animals, is classified in our Earth sea life. But looking at the dialogue, or dialogue, but the wiki articles and uh, articles, whatever, the, um, the information when you scan it, it is not the anemones your, itself you're eating. You're basically eating like this fruit, this heart that uh, develops off the tentacles or the tendrils. The, uh, originally, it was called ice fruit, but they renamed it to the anemone heart. But again, it's not not an animal you're eating. It is simply just like a vegetation that grows off their, their tendrils. Here we go, outpost zero. All right, let's get uh, let's get the hell out of here. All right, so if there's the uh, outpost facility right there. If you continue up to the north, there is this path. Uh, you can actually see this early game, but it doesn't really mean much to you until you get to this point in the game. So it's one of those interesting things where the end of the game is right shown at the beginning, and then you kind of loop around as the story takes you there. Here we go. Actually, this is, yeah, this was in my intro. Or my yeah, yeah, intro, there we go. So we should be able to get in here now. And there is Alan doing Are his thing. Alright, let's get this over with. Hey, there's a portal. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to end it right here. Uh, if you want to see what happens at the other end of this, uh, there is my series you can watch, but this is the end of the game. There is absolutely no way to fail, no way to die. So we, we win. Yay! Here we go. Alright, this has been Genosis with the finale or episode nine of Sonatica Below Zero, The Vegetarian Challenge. If you like what you saw here today, like the video, and if you'd like to see some more in the future, consider subscribing if you haven't already. Thanks for everyone who's watched this uh, series. I know it was uh, a little of a detour from my usual content, but what the hell? I really wanted to do this challenge for a long time. I've tried it on stream a couple times, and uh, <laughs> that was good practice for this run. And that's it. Thanks for watching and catch you next time.